you're from my home state. Yeah, Winter Haven, Florida. Good. My name good. is John Heron. Good. I'm here with my partner Evan. Good. We're through the yesterday's clinic. Yeah. This is partner. But as far as really support people, you know, when we left that clinic, she says, "Also, you know, the clinic really helps." You know, the questions come up. We talk on the internet. And there's so much information. Start remembering all these things. Well, there's also some good research in the medical literature. Right. In other words, <laughs> if you've watched everybody go through this, if you know the staff, you. well, then it, it's interesting. You're less worried about what's going to happen next. Uh -huh. And we find that all the time. Our nurses on it, they say, your patients are so knowledgeable. I expect that you really have a good insight on what to expect. You heard about most people just go through the surgery, and today will be a long day, kind of sitting and waiting, but. Of your yeah, I mentioned to my partner this morning, I said, you know, I think I'd be more nervous going to the dentist today than going to have the surgery. Right. Right. I mean, you know, but yeah, all the um, information is what really made me decide on the, this procedure. Oh, you are? I've ran forms for oh, years. Oh, wait, wait, you guys are a website designer? You are? Yeah. Okay, now this, I was going to say that. I was going to say that. I get it. It's not bad at all, being that it's text and the way the menu system. Yeah. <laughs> okay, did you hear that? Did you hear that? Yeah, and those tricky, you know those tricky text that draws you in. Yeah, That's right. uh, <laughs> it's just uh, all that information. And, you know, we're not just looking at the information on this surgery, we're looking at all the other talking about. I'm thinking, they didn't learn better than that, you know. You know, they're saying they just had surgery three weeks ago. <laughs> it's scary. Uh, that it sometimes weird. bothers me, but on the other hand, that's that's One real. What we that's find is that can lead to problems. So it's important to know a year and a half ago, a little over a year and a half ago, I got a telephone call from one of my former patients. He had an operation. They stitched up this ulcer. And two weeks later, his sister, who was also a patient of mine, called me and said, I said, I understand. She, she said, though, I do need to tell you something. Uh, smoke cigarettes, drank alcohol took aspirin, and never did any of the other things. What do you think I should do? I said, well, I wouldn't drink alcohol. I was to say, again, one of the nice things about our experience, hopefully that today, technically, I'm good, because I've done lots of cases, because thousands of other people have had the surgery, and they talk to me. They can call me. They can ask about questions and problems. So we have a good long-term experience to have, yeah, especially, again, you're from so far away. Well, good. So, right. All right. Thank you very much. We look forward to seeing you later.